The release of the 2018 Closing the Gap report is a time for reflection. Reflection in my portfolio on the advances we're making in education for Indigenous Australians, but also, of course, the challenges that still lie ahead. We're pleased to see progress, real progress, in terms of achieving our target of 95% enrolment of young Indigenous children in early education, in preschool settings. We're also pleased to see strong gains in terms of Year 12 completions, a real sign that we are making good inroads. But there's still much more to be done to truly close the gap in terms of educational attainment for Indigenous Australians. That's why over the course of the next year, we'll continue to be focused, focused on delivering of our commitments for opportunities in preschool settings for Indigenous children to learn in our language, but also to better learn English. We're going to roll out technologies that we use elsewhere around Australia to teach foreign languages to children to help ensure that English is accessible in as many Indigenous communities as possible. We're also making sure that our Connected Beginnings program that brings together all of the different service agencies at the youngest ages is rolled out in more sites, providing more opportunities for not just better education, but better integrated services for young Indigenous Australians. This will be coupled with delivery this year of reports into educational excellence in Australian schools by David Gonski and our review of regional and remote education, critical of course again to Indigenous attainment. We're determined to keep on with the task of making gains, of closing the gap, of working with Indigenous Australia. Thank you for your support so far. Thanks for all the gains we've made. We look forward to continuing to work with everybody to keep improving and closing the gap.